I wanted to have double jump in my game. So uh, for situations like this, so for example, this player at the moment can't reach up to this platform. So what I've done is I've put down here a pickup and now I've got double jump. So I can double jump up to here and I can access that level. So it's a simple little power up. Let me show you how that works in the code. So uh, actually I'll start in tiled and you can see I've added a whole new layer just for the double jump power ups. And on it, I just have that one double jump uh, sprite down here, so right there. And it's called a double jump. So in the code, I've uh, imported that. Let's just find out where. Here we are. This double jump list is uh, coming from that double jump layer. And I draw it. Those are all things that are kind of necessary. And in the update section, I've got a whole uh, chunk here, a small chunk, I should say, for the double jump. So uh, we've seen this check for collision with list before, checking the player sprite against the double jump list. Uh, if we get any hits, we've got something in the hit list then. So in that case, the length of the hit list is greater than zero. So if the length of the hit list is greater than zero, it goes down here. And I found this handy little function in the physics engine. Remember, I'll just scroll up to where the physics engine is initialized. Self.physics engine uh, with a sprite and the walls. That's what we're changing down here. Where were we? Here. And enable multi-jump. Um, and I'll talk about what that for is in a second. Um, and what I also wanted to do was, once I've enabled the multi-jump with that little uh, sprite there, is I then um, get rid of it. So I've used this, I've killed that sprite. Uh, this hit list is a list, but it's a list of one thing. There's, we're only going to be colliding with one sprite, because there is only one double jump sprite. So I know it's the first item in the list, and that's how we refer to the first item in the list. Remember, when we're working with lists, we start from zero, zero, one, two, three, four. So the zeroth item is actually what we would call the first item, and we're getting rid of it. So that's how that works. Uh, what's this number four? That's how many multi jumps you get. So if I, I've enabled my multi jump now, and if we do a count, I'll go one, two, three, four, and then I fall to earth. I can do one, two, I can do double jump, triple jump quadruple jump but then I start falling down uh, so a more normal number to put here would probably be two uh, but you know whatever all right so that's do it using a sprite um, in here in my double jump uh, layer importing that into tiled and then checking against that and enabling double jump as needed when I collide with it